Oh, why they gotta go ahead and pick on my man Odell? That's crazy. All right, welcome back to another video, reaction video to be exact. My name is Nate Push Weights. Now, we're gonna be reacting to a video of OBJ getting kicked off a plane. Now, he, we knew about this news about like three, four months ago. Um, I actually, well, actually, no, it was like two, three months ago, something like that, where Odell was pretty much trying to get signed by a team and he was traveling from LA to somewhere else. And he got kicked off the plane. And, uh, you know, the media made a big, big deal about this. Let's take a look at this right now. Are you able to get up? Can you get up, please? You okay? Yeah. What's wrong? The airline's called for you, sir. I don't know what it is. You good? How you doing, bud? I don't think you'll be on the response. I'm trying to get to a man's response. He's probably on a deep sleep. He's sleeping. Why you waking up? Why everybody staring at Odell like that? <laughs> you know where he at, sir? Nigga, he got a flight to wherever. Of course he know where he at. He looks good to me. What? Careful. No, Where's his pants? Where's the baby's pants? Where's the baby's pants? Hold on, what? Oh, man, they disrespect. Did they just call, did, did they just call this man a baby? Hold on, hold on. Where's his pants? Where's his pants? Where's the baby's pants? Where's the baby's pants? You only got his underwear. Yeah. Underwear. Yeah, they're on. Are they on now? Yeah. Yeah. They weren't on before. No. Go back. Go back, Frank. Okay. Go back. Go back. We're good. Yes. Yeah. We're good. Yo, the crazy thing is, she called this man a baby, bro. That's tough, man. They disrespecting these celebrities out here, bro. Do you know how many times you're shaking him to get his seatbelt on and he Listen, he might, I mean, you don't want him to fly. That's a decision that you guys are going to have to make. That's, you know, you tell the captain, and then we'll, we'll get him out. But that's something that you guys got to make. My man probably just sitting there not making no noise. He probably drunk as shit. That's cool. You can be drunk on an airplane. He probably just sitting there just not. Not listen to anybody, which is cool. I mean, yeah, you probably do have to put a seatbelt on. Maybe put it on for him. Maybe not. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think. They kicking him off the plane. He don't seem to be saying a damn word. That's tough. Sir, sir, put your seatbelt on. All we're getting is this. I, this is a five-hour flight. Yeah, this is five hours. Okay. Then that's up to you guys. Yeah, yeah, no, that's up to you guys. Five-hour flight, Medically, okay. if he doesn't want us to check him out, I can't make it. And I don't really say anything wrong. He might be tired. Or have to take a long trip and doesn't want to follow orders, that's a whole other app. He told her he just came from a bottle. Yeah. Okay, I get that. He's tired. He just came from a club. He not he not responding to y'all. That's tough. Um I don't know what I don't know what the rules are on the airplane stuff, because I don't really fuck with airplanes like that. I'm uh, listen, that's not my type of spiel. Odell is taking a five hour flight. He came from a club, so he fucked up, etc. He probably falling asleep, obviously. At that point, I think you, what do you do? I don't think you kick him off because, like, you know, what do you kick him off for? Maybe you say, sir, I'm going to put your seatbelt on for you, whatever, boom, boom, then you good. I think they knew who the hell he was, okay? They had to know who he was, bro. I don't know. He just responded to know where he's at. He knows where he's at, exactly where he's flying. And he had pants on when he came on. He had, he had that pants on now. His pants are on now. His pants are on. Well, he had shorts on. Yeah. Okay. We, we'll do whatever you decide. They said his pants if are down. If you want, we'll stand by out here. But I, I, is his pants down? I don't know. Because I don't know what's going to happen. Right. I don't know what you want us to do as far as fire rescue. He's mad at us because we called you. I said we're worried about you. That's fine. You guys are doing your, you guys are doing your job. He's going to go deteriorate once we get in the air. Of course. So he's all don't worry. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't hear you. No, he doesn't want to come off. He does not want to come off. Okay. Advise the sergeant to come here. Um, motor 70s on the way. He needs to come off. We're gonna to have to deport everybody. Okay. First everybody. Oh, Dell said I ain't getting off. Fuck. <laughs> oh man, just because a late like. All y'all had to do was say, okay, the cops here, make him put his shit on. Boom, we good. Now we can fly. Now they made this into a whole scene. The media didn't pick this up. And the media made this whole incident. Oh, my God. Y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think. I think this is way overblown. Oh, 
Yeah. Yeah. Everybody mad. Everybody mad at Odell because <laughs> he literally just sit there and I say it up. But all they had to do was say, "Yo, we can fly. We'll just put the damn shit on himself. We'll just we'll we'll put him in the seatbelt, whatever it is. Let's go. <laughs> we ain't gotta we ain't gotta deep plane everything because a, 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 a flight attendant said we gotta kick him off. What? We ain't even say nothing. <laughs> They yeah, about to curse passengers out and shit. Hey, hey, hey. Ever in my life, get off the plane for you, specifically you. Oh, somebody was talking shit. <laughs> somebody was talking shit. They told him to get off the plane, so that's why he. That's why he probably sat there and was like, "All right, I got to prove a point. These motherfuckers ain't gonna tell me what to do." I feel you. Maybe everybody else. I'm gonna get off the plane. That shit don't mean nothing to me. Ain't no way you could look at me. Ever. 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 You gonna wait 40 minutes, and I'm gonna be on a private plane home. Oh, yeah. shit. Two fat ass. Yeah, I will. Get your ass off the plane for a second. Yeah, I bet. Enjoy the cheese board on the way home. <laughs> shit don't mean nothing to me, bro. He said, he said to drink cheese board on the way home. That's tough. <laughs> Got like fucked up. I'm sorry. All you had to do was wake me up. All you had to do is wake him up. You heard him. He, he, all you had to do is wake my boy up. That's tough. <laughs> hey, yo. I don't condone what he what he was saying to the dude, the old man and shit. I, I really don't condone that just because, like, yo, you had a stature where you could just say what the fuck you want. You could do what you want. You don't even need to stoop down to old man level, man. You know what I mean? But I get it, you know? You ain't really on the field no more like that. And, you know, you you feel as though you got you to gotta talk to these motherfuckers. Put them in their place because, listen, just like you said, you can just get a private jet right now and be on the way home. That's tough. <laughs> Oh man, Odell still got it. Um, this seems to be a a, a misunderstanding, but you know it's just how life is, man. You know, we all become great, and after our greatness, people like to look down on us. That's tough. But that's pretty much it for this video. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Odell Beckham Jr. did get kicked off that flight, but he's still a G. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching.